All right, welcome back to the new account experience. This is episode number 23. Uh, we really quickly got another star on or a star on Huntress, level 20. I would have liked to have avoided that, but we got a star to unlock Mystic. Um, again, I'm not going to count as an attempt. I flat out just deleted the character. Best level 20, best alive fame 20. That's a shame. Uh, if we'd gotten 19, we could have gotten through that without getting a single star. Um... Sorcerer Mystic, Trickster Ninja. Okay, uh, so we're going to start Mystic now. I know we're jumping past Huntress, which I'm not thrilled about, but uh, we talked about it a bit. It's just to hit, um, it's just so our 24-hour PPE is, you know, with that, that'll be this weekend. Uh, the game plan is uh, whatever we can get by Friday. Uh, it's 10 o'clock Monday night currently, uh, and ideally I won and done Mystic. I cannot, I, I'd, if I... I could maybe five star by then, maybe. It's very unlikely. I don't. I'd have to like either get super lucky with runs or availability. Um, but the latter half of my week is busy, so basically, unless we get something crazy like a tier fourteen spellblade, a conflict, a um, whatever it's called, the uh, come on, name, Prima Arcana. Unless we get something crazy, we're probably not going to keep it. Uh, if we hit like 12k, if, if we're like very close, I probably will. Um, because we could quickly 5 star both Mystic and uh, Huntress in a single, like, no, <laughs> like two days. Uh, and then that gives us more room to work with for the end game because we need at least four, five stars in order to hit Yellow Star by the end of the account. So, game plan, set in motion, you know, we'll do our best, cross our fingers, we get something cool, but we once again have to farm for sulfuric wetlands. So, everything's shit. <laughs> we'll see how we do, uh, we'll crawl through it, all my usual catchphrases that you're very used to hearing and very sick of by now. <laughs> Aside from wetlands, what do we really need early game? I don't remember a lot of Mystic's base stats, I will admit it's been a while since I've done a Mystic PPE. As much like I, I will consider this probably one of my favorite classes, but I can't ever really PPE it. It's just got a very pretty like look to it. I like the whole feel of the class. That's our um slightly above average. So okay, so I should you kind of need to just do a lot of everything, Shit. kind of. Which I guess is good for wetlands because if I get the Bogwood Crook first time, I will be sorely upset, though, just because of how long I put into it on Necromancer. But, uh, I don't know. We'll see. God, another Tier 9 robe. No, I can't do more of these. I can't. I can't. I'm more or less just mad about that death because I was so close to fucking 15k. Oh, whatever. It's fine. Clueless. We'll just stew about it for a while. I keep forgetting how low Mystic's health is. I remember I, uh, a long time ago, back uh, when Halls 2.0 first came out, there was still no Minrex, and I would just kind of roll up with a, uh, like a fucking, as soon as I got a health ring, I would start doing Halls. I know we do that for O3 now, but I would uh, just kind of roll up as soon as I got a health ring and, you know, go into it, and this is back when that was still, like, the hardest thing in the game. Um, a very shit idea. Uh, because it's still pretty scary without with low defense. The lowest I ever got was a tier 6 staff on a Mystic, and I got a Star Mother from, like, the third run in. And the nice part is, is there are no exalts, so you could just do MBC like that, and then, you know, the fucking big government stepped in and was like, oh, let's go make a minimum Rex. Let's go make it a tier 9, tier 3, tier 9, tier 3. And I was like, shit, that's terrible. And now it's fucking tops. So, you know, I don't know. Game progression. Oh, hell yeah. Tier 7 Spellblade. Back at it, boys. This is our last staff class, too. Like, this is our last chance to really see the Spellblades in action. Honestly? Safely so I'm not a fucking necromancer. These things are pretty fucking cool. Oh, you weren't lying. Uh, all my stats are in 20s and 30s. Yeah, exactly. Okay, well, this will be a bit. I cannot wait to die in this wetlands. <laughs> These are these everything here is stasis immune. Okay, well that's not that's not terrible <laughs> at all. Holy shit! Okay, that's great. 
I'd like to, like, as much as I'd like to take Mystic a bit slower and kind of, like, enjoy this class, I, it's better to just rush the end game because we're on a time limit, which is kind of the whole thesis statement of this account. I'm putting unnecessarily, like, a stress on myself to hit Kensei by the uh, winter events. And, you know, you could, I, I already see the sea of comments that I'm surprised I haven't really gotten yet, but I think it's mainly because we've, like, only been more vocal about it in the more recent episodes that haven't been uploaded by the time this is out. Of just, oh, slow down. Like, it doesn't matter if you, you know, don't exalt Kensei. By that time, just enjoy the game. No. <laughs> I have a very particular way of doing these things, and I really would like to exalt Kensei. And yes, I'm keenly aware of the fact that you can exalt Kensei outside of the winter events. It is very frustrating to exalt characters on their own especially when you're only using public discords like fungal that don't really run so i would like to hit kensei by then and even then we can still you know enjoy our characters we can still do weird shit like the miserable player experience and i was thinking about doing samurai as a upe if we have the time for it for the time for samurai as a upe i would like to actually give that a shot um we could in that regard bounce around on characters um and do Sam and do Samurai before Bard. And if it doesn't look like we're going to have time to do a UPE, then we will just do a normal one. But we'll think about it because I just want to guarantee that we have a character, like a good Kensei for that event, because that's not something I want to miss. Uh, for now, though, current plans is just to run wetlands uh, and wine cellars and maybe a couple early O3s to try and get as good of gear as possible early. And uh, just kind of cross our fingers, really, that uh, the game is generous with us in the early game. Uh, here's the problem with Mystic and other staff classes. 500 and fucking, like, 70 health at level 20 is uh, criminally low. Even 679 is, like, scary. So, you, like, we, I would like to go for Solus as soon as possible. Uh, not only because of the ST set is for this class... But also just in general. Uh, we've already drank four defense, which means that this character is going to uh, die. Because that's how all of these work. So, you know, maybe attempt two goes better. Holy fuck, I got a him. Okay, and another defense. Interesting. Game seems real insistent on giving me that. 31 speed com in conjunction with 570 health. Yeah, we're dead. <laughs> oh, hey, tier 3 orb. Nice. It won't save us, but Pete... Oh, white, white. Hang on, please be a banner. I- why? <sighs> Stop giving me these! Stop! Stop! <laughs> I've got a fourth- I got a fourth shielding. <laughs> and banner would have saved my ass. Oh my fucking god. Okay, well that was the biggest hate crime I've ever experienced. Pot shot at boys, what am I getting? Okay, interesting inventory. I think I dropped to, at one point I think I dropped to like single digits. I'm going to have to go find that clip, but uh, that's the most amount of HP pots I've used in an O3 in a long time. Whatever, blue bag. Red. I did not get a bag, what? There's no bag here. I got a tier 14 wand. That was the biggest heartbreak I've ever had. Well, we get our uh, we got our second star from this. Uh, time to make the uh, <coughs> obligatory joke of uh, time to die now. But uh, white bag, please. No, just another fucking. I'm 16 fucking defense to max. Holy shit. Oh, what the fuck? I got a hook from a pirate cave. Whatever. Holy fuck, I forgot how scary this dungeon is with Spider Swarm. I'm so excited to see the boss just fucking turn into Australia. It's gonna be gas as fuck. Oh shit, tier 9 Spellblade. Nice. <laughs> oh shit, a tier 3 HP ring. Oh my god, we're gonna live. Fuck the Griffin Hide, but we're gonna live. Well, time to do another O3 with... Oh, we actually have an HP ring this in time, never mind. And I'm pretty sure we get Tunnel Rat from the Y... Hi okay. Dama. That's not good, but that's the earliest tunnel rat I've ever seen. We go from 719 to 6.2 thousand. Holy fuck. Okay. Let me be the 2-4 dimethylformamide to your phenylalanine. <laughs> what the hell? 
<laughs> That's so fucking fire. <laughs> Alright, fellas, what are we getting? Oh my god, I'm trading fucking Joseph here. I'm so ready to get nothing. Call it, boys. What do? Well, hang on. What are we all getting, boys? Triple blue? Go fuck yourself, Will. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Bare minimum. Did you get a blue? I got absolutely nothing. Great! Quadruple blue, because fucking Rulizu's really got a blue, too. I'm killing myself. I'm 15 attack to max. Uh, like, Wiz isn't too bad to get. The only real problem stat I have is 26 speed. That's painful. We should probably do snake pits anyways for the ring snake guy. But, you know... Mm. It's so easy for me to put speed off. Our life mana is looking pretty good. Our equipment is still pretty bad. Uh, just kind of looking at it, but maybe we'll improve. Oh, Astral. Nice. Sick. Another fucking tier 11 staff on a character. Holy shit. Not again. Oh, ST. Please be the ring. I'm begging you for once. Oh, no. <laughs> Literally nothing else. <laughs> just the ring. Okay, um, hmm, Bloodstone or XHP? I think XHP is better. That's annoying. I like the 40 health. The 4 defense doesn't matter. You'd have to get hit, uh, like, fucking 10 times in order to make a difference. Okay. Yeah, I'll take it. It's good for shatters, too. Nice, okay. Wine Cellars have been pretty generous to us on this character. Hey, uh, I keep putting off speed. I keep I slow as fuck. <laughs> I should probably go max after this O3. I could max my mana from this, which would be pretty sick, and be one life to max if we're really lucky, but doubtful. Oh, of course, I got a fucking blue bag. Oh my gosh. Like, okay, you know what? At least we're one mana to max. We'll we'll take it. We'll take it. Not terrible. Oh, check this shit out. We're, we've gone from El Femboy to El Racista. <laughs> Holy shit, this looks terrible. After seeing myself as blue for so long, Christ almighty. Fucking hell, I don't like that. Get me out of here. <laughs> oh, I got a blueprint. Please, at least pots. Oh my god, not even pots. It's coin blueprint. I honestly may forge a coin on Trickster, though, to be honest, just so I can, like, tolerate the class. I know it's for losers and pussies, but you're never gonna believe this. I'm a loser and a pussy, so we probably will. Oh my fucking god, what did you get? Yeah, I didn't. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, thank god. Okay, you stop. <laughs> Thank God, finally. <laughs> I was kind of worried we'd be stuck with that forever. Like, obviously not, like, forever, but uh, it's a good defense increase. We're up to our 30s. Uh, if we get a better um, staff and a better orb, we can go run chatters. Maybe I'll get the slow orb from the hive, though, to be honest, just because it, like, quote-unquote meets requirements, even though, it, you know, it's not very good. Oh, shit. Oh, yo, immediately we get another better robe. Okay, uh, I guess that solves that problem. <laughs> um, nice, and again, better defense, better pizza. Uh, and uh, I, I like the ST bag sprite. It, uh, okay, um, weird. <laughs> I need that Panerac, though. That sucks, honestly. Oh, I was kind of open for a third. Oh, man. Like, a ring would have honestly been, like, legitimately nice there, though, just because I may try and get the entire ST set because it's not like it doesn't take too long to get. But, um, like, that's pretty great, honestly. Even just getting one, I'm pretty happy about, but a second. Um, 700 feed power, we might as well feed it. Our stats are looking pretty good. 35 defense is pretty nice. So we have the health from that, which means uh, once we get a better staff and orb, again, we can just do shatters. Um, I think I'm going to, if I max my life here, even if I don't, I'm probably just going to, you know, stop doing O3s for a bit and just focus on maxing my stats. Um, that seems like a better way to spend my time. I'm not getting anything from this. Yeah. <laughs> you know, just like, it just seems like a, like, not a waste. <laughs> oh, whatever. Please give us two life. Oh my god! Okay, fuck off. 
It's just nothing ever. <laughs> Holy shit. White, 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 white. Please, please. God, God, please. Oh, fucking sh I'm so... <sighs> Whatever. Whatever, I max my life. <laughs> that means we can nexus on site from this blue bag that we're about to get. What happened? <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> hey, I did a rotation for once. And little <laughs> idiot boy didn't. Yeah, okay. That was that, that was, was bullshit. What the fuck what was the that? What the fuck was that? Why do we have 13 people? Hello? What well, the one of the retards weird. died. In 10 people remaining. Let's see if I get anything. Blue bat. Oh, red. Oh my fucking god. Jesus Christ. Okay. Oh, that's real charming. I said, um... I said, what dog shit Discord is this? And the raid leader just goes fucking feral saying, kill yourself, a beast cunt. Okay, that's real charming. I like that one. That That's real charming. That's, um, that's a good way to handle that situation when your Discord does a horrible run. I like that. Okay, thanks, Corridge. That's, uh, that's a real charming way to uh, handle that situation. Yeah, the more of these things I've done, I I don't know. I the minions deal way too much damage, and I get it. It's a higher end dungeon. Like it, it probably takes about as much time as the crawling depths, but it's just so much less manageable to like solo. Like the 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 crawling depths solo isn't that bad. This is extremely frustrating to solo. I don't know. It mm, even for like a decent character. Like if I did a C depths on this character, it wouldn't take nearly as long. The minions deal way more damage than they probably should. And maybe I'm just a little biased because I've done like 60 of these things and I have yet to even see the staff. So that's probably where a lot of my frustration comes from. But I will not be complaining when I get that and I no longer have to do these. Except for Huntress where I've got to still do them for the um, trap and then obviously our katana classes. But I would like to have a bit of a break. I think it just seems strange. They put a decent amount of, like, testing. Like, they advertise the wetlands on testing. But normally when they introduce a new dungeon, there's some sort of event for it. In terms of, like, like there's a whole spectacle on testing. But if you ignore that side of the game, the, this was a very casual thing that they released. You'd think them releasing a new dungeon for the first time since, what? I guess the Hidden Interregnum? But really... What, Orcs' Sanctuary? you think there'd be a bigger in-game spectacle for it. I just think it's rather odd that they just kind of dropped it on us and was like, we're not going to do any event. We're hardly going to even acknowledge it in-game. That's just interesting. White, 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 white. Oh my god, please, 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 please. I got armor? Yeah, armor's trash, man. I'm really, really trying not to get mad at this, but I'm sick of this. Cool, we maxed our attack and almost died in the process. We're fucking 3-8 at 3,000 fame. Please tell me somebody sniffered that. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck. That was the dumbest fucking thing. If you guys get more than me, I'm going to be sorely upset. <laughs> Blue bag! <sighs> oh. Like I'm I'm not I'm I'm not like mad about this. I'm just kind of tired of like I I'd like to get a move on. I'd like to not, you know. I'd like to get some better shit. <laughs> is what I'm saying. Like I'm having fun with Mystic, but like I'd really like to you know, maybe try and get something above what we have because we're about at 88 and I'd like to be 15k by Friday. So like let's 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 get a move on, please. Better staff, better orb, and we're, we're good to go. But we still have a decent way towards maxing our stats. UDLs could give us um, a tier 5 orb, and we're not even going to talk about the ST staff because that thing isn't real. Um, we could also just do them low level. We could do sentry cults. Maybe. I don't know. We have options that I don't really want. So uh, The ideal is we just get a cosmic, but we'll see. Oh, wait. Oh, Will, I'm going to be sorry. Actually, I'm sorry for myself 
Fuck off. <laughs> of course, my next character is Huntress, and the game goes, you know what? You're not getting this. No way. Oh, shit, wait. Not, oh, pff, no Dex. <laughs> That's heat, though. EP. Take it. Love it. Finally, a fucking melee, or, uh, wait, one of our, I think our wizard got an EP. I don't know. Heat, though. At least the seat up's clear. There are no dead ends. So it's like the same time clearing, but you physically can't go the wrong fucking way. This little shit dungeon. Yeah, you can waste your time. Hi. <laughs> this dungeon sucks. I'm waiting to never do one. Of and this is tea room. Okay. Well, we don't need that either. Oh, so this entire thing that I just spent three minutes on is all wrong. Okay. Oh my god, they did not listen to players' feedback about this dungeon. I heard prior to this dungeon being, like, I heard in the middle of fucking testing, like, day one of it, people were like, wow, this does too much damage. People kept saying that, and lo and behold, they have not changed the minion damage value, so it's still... Really? Okay, really? Are you fucking kidding... Fuck you. Guess we're going to we're sidelining Mystic for now. I'm I'm going to go start on Trickster. We'll do our second attempt on Yeah, that that that's just a bad fucking dungeon at this rate. Holy sh why can that pop you as a fucking max life character? Hello? Holy shit, especially cuz those fuckers appear out of nowhere. That is not a balanced fucking dungeon design. Holy shit, they should have put this through testing more. Actually listen to player feedback about it. Christ, whatever. Um Great, we're going to try and 5-star Trickster, I guess, uh, do a 24-hour PP, and then we'll fucking restart Mystic, I guess, because holy shit. Can't have you giving that to anyone else. Goodbye. <laughs> it's kind of annoying to bounce around. I really did want to do all the characters, like, linearly. I cannot play Mystic again after that character for now. I just need a break. We're going to gun for 4 stars. We'll kill it, like, immediately after, um, which may happen before Friday. If it does, we'll get a character off the ground. Um, but I, uh, the problem is, is I don't want it to be like a solid episode, like a like a half an episode for it. So we'll probably like play Trickster for the entire week up until Friday. Uh, as soon as Friday hits, it dies if it's above four stars or four stars plus. Uh, and then this weekend, we start the 24 hour. We crawl through that. And then afterward, we do Mystic. Sounds like a plan. Sure does. I'm a little mad right now because... Wow, that dungeon is really fucking bad. <laughs> hey, nice. That's actually an okay bag. I don't like this class, by the way. We mentioned it before. I don't. I never bothered to learn how to decoy, so this is going to be like the worst fucking skill set you've ever seen on this account. But whatever. <laughs> oh, tier eight blades. Uh, I I like these things. <laughs> Fuck it. I'm down. Oh, white. Nice. Mm. <laughs> whatever how much feed power is void blade 750 that's low whatever it hits level we hit level 88 with that oh nice tier 10 blades i have literally never seen these things before let's check our rolls our mana is pretty good 21 life to max go fuck yourself everything else 29 wisdom this is how little i play trickster 29 for what so y this thing gives wisdom what you j yeah, smarter some shit. You teleport faster, clueless. What the Kentucky Fried fuck? Why is it 29 wisdom to max? Oh shit, T3 HPing. Oh my god, thank god. Holy shit, I got an agate claw. Okay, I know what, I'm using the blades out of spite. Fuck this. Alright, well, painless except the fucking counter or I got whipped. Uh, whatever. Maybe we get a red bag, clueless. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> no. Oh, whatever. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> I kind of like where I'm at right now uh, because these are all going to be uploaded very separately. But uh, for context, it is Tuesday, 10 p.m. My necromancer died. Maybe about 12 hours ago. Less, slightly less than that. So, uh... That would kind of explain... 
why my mood's been a little rotten. <laughs> because that's just been, you know, two days of getting my shit pushed in. Um, but yeah, we, we still have another attempt at Mystic. We'll do that next week, probably. Uh, I think if I hit, like, a si if I have a single character where I die with only three stars, like, that's it. We're not hitting yellow star after that, because we have the five star five characters, and that's too many. Um, which would be annoying, but we'll be close anyways. Uh, but yeah, we'll just... <laughs> yeah, Christ. It's not nice Moonshoot's design and more Dekka's refusal to, like, readjust, I, uh, enemies, but, yeah, we'll fucking no life our early dungeons. Trickster's got some horrible stats. Okay, write that one down. I love Trickster! It's my favorite class! Oh, great, another fucking tier 3? <laughs> Prism, we're almost back to where we were. It's like nothing ever happened to Clueless. A T3 defense ring. One of those characters where we don't get anything better. I'm 24 life to max. What's everything else? 37 speed, 30 deck. Oh my god. You know what? We... We... We, we, we talked about, you know, less complaining in a previous video. I'm not even mad. It's more with threes. It's more with threes. We get to do more with threes. We get to do more with threes. It's more chances for an avarice or a coin. I'm not mad. I am... I am on... I am skating the edge here, fellas. We're about to fucking have a whole psychotic break. We're gonna go... I don't know. What's what's something age like appropriate I can say for YouTube that won't get me banned? Nothing. Literally nothing I can think of in this situation is a good thing to say. Hey, we got our T3 H period... Uh, that's why I bothered to look. That was a T3 vit ring. You trust like, yourself to know that there's going to be a snake coming in the toilet. Like, how? Always. How, how are you going to know? Dude, I was half deaf for 18 years. What? That means that I know what, what's coming up the toilet. What? Exactly. That was me for 18 <laughs> Damn, years. Damn, okay. <laughs> but, uh, oh, nice. Okay, I got a fucking purple bag. But how would you know if a snake is coming up the toilet? Really? How would you not know? Like, you don't just sense it with your butt hairs? I was going to... I'm keeping this in. <laughs> I'm... You're keeping I'm... I'm, keep... I'm keeping this in. Yeah. I unmuted my audio for this conversation. That's hilarious. Let me tell you, um... that was the last thing I expected you to say. <laughs> like, probably dead last. But thank you. Hey, of course, of course. You... Yeah. That means that is actually somewhat appropriate to be in a video. Oh, wait. Oh, holy shit, I got a fucking acidic armor. Holy crap, and a, I guess a punji too, that's kind of heat, but go fuck yourself, Will. <laughs> hey, all three of us can use this, none of us will use anything from it, because we won't get anything. Hey, fellas, one of us is getting something from this. Well, it's not you. <laughs> okay, go fuck yourself. <laughs> well, it's not me either. Oh, it is me. <laughs> Oh no, what'd you get? <laughs> Holy shit. Hey! What'd you get? Well, go in the wood lab. Well, I have you a little bitch. bit of consolation. You and I are matching. <laughs> oh, nice green. <laughs> hey, we cracked two stars. The obligatory joke about being fine with dying now that we've made every single time we've died since the paladin. Wait. It's gonna be a fucking. It's gonna be a divinity. It's gonna be a divinity. It's a gladiator guard and a UB Dex. Okay, well, that's a deletion. Okay. <laughs> oh, and he also gets a Leviathan. Okay, well, I'm <laughs> 18 life and one mana. Okay, interesting. Huh, I got an a common and an uncommon avian egg. I want to get a bag where it's all eggs <laughs> of the same type. That's I don't. I kind of was hoping I'd get a legendary egg, but you know it's not happening. One of us gets something from this. <laughs> okay. Well. Nice well, foul. Oh, there's a wood dab. Oh, cool. Oh, thank you. Mango chum. Nice. Okay. Well, best of luck. I'm still lagging. Calm, <laughs> calm down. I got a red. Fuck me. I got a staff. Oh, I'm 14 life to max, and I'm fucking 1-8 in mana. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> That's the worst. I love still having to do like fucking a maximum of seven o three. So I'm gonna do ten o three without getting exalts. White. Get nanaed. <laughs> uh, <laughs> my inventory is all just a shitload of middle feed power items. There's no way. Yeah, get nanaed. Let's go look. Hey, hi. Ooh, I'm look at that. <laughs> yeah, I think that. I think honestly, the one exception to me killing this thing at five uh, thousand fame is if I get a coin. Theoretically, we talked about this earlier, I could just forge it. I have coin blueprint, and if I get four legendary items in the next three and a half thousand fame for some fucking reason, I'll forge a coin. Um, but no, it does kind of look like we're shaping up to uh, kill it. Holy shit! How I saw you run in there, and I was like, hey, he's dead. <laughs> How the, we're dead. how the fuck did I survive that? What are Minecraft Cheez-Its? Hold on. Minecraft. You know, I think I know what you're talking about. I'm going to keep this in the video. It's real. Yeah. It's fucking I mean, real? Yeah. Obviously... The box is gonna get recycled, but I've hidden them away, so now I have a box of Minecraft Cheez Its forever. But I did eat the Cheez Its. Of course. I'm not gonna waste them. Honestly, I like my room decor. I like my desk trinkets. I got a load of them, so maybe Minecraft Cheez Its is gonna be added to the collection. Oh, I got a backpack. Uh, I'm gonna save that for my Huntress. <laughs> I'm not fucking wasting it on this character. I'm gonna put that on the 24 hour Huntress skirt. The advantage of us only going for 5k and killing this thing like immediately after, unless we get like a fucking coin for some reason, is, uh, let's be real, we don't need 8-8, and I don't think I will. I don't think I'm going to get that 31 speed to max. Like, we have the option to, but we're already at 2k, um, and we're like nowhere near, so we could just honestly gun for with threes until we die, which is nice, because it means that Trickster will be the only character to not get its own thumbnail, <laughs> which is hilarious. Holy fuck. Okay. That's the second mini event boss skin I've gotten. I've gotten both mini Sphinx and mini Lottle. Oh, crap! I got a tier 5 prism. That's sick. That's how I suicide it. Shanked percent. <laughs> so you don't want someone changing the name to Epic Ice Hat. Yeah, that would be so bad if someone changed their name to Epic Ice Hat. <laughs> Another bad video idea. What if I did a PPE where I could only I could I could only use items of a specific color type. Like if I did like a fucking sorcerer where I could only use red items. <laughs> Holy shit, that is such a bad idea. Did I just get another Ray Katana? Okay. Well, I'm using that to forge a fucking spear dagger. <laughs> well, we can uh, forge a spear dagger. I guess I'll get rid of the snake eye ring. Um, this is just so that we meet Rex for shatters when we do our um, <laughs> our fucking shank percent. I got a white. Well, I got an escutcheon, so. <laughs> white. I got a white. He used six health pots because I got cornered. But I, uh... Enforcer time. It's okay. I didn't get anything. Okay, well, we'll put. Oh, look at that, we're twins. <laughs> Both of us did. Hey, here's our four star, and we uh, can now go do shank percent. I. Okay, well, I got a fucking retribution and a tier 7 orb. <laughs> uh, we basically gotta just book it to Archmage and find lockup, and then see if we can TP into the cells and get fucking shanked. <laughs> That's the goal. Is there lockup? We need to know. Continue up. Bottom right? I'm going. 
Oh, you're right. You're right. Yo! <laughs> we did it! We did it. Stop the timer. Stop the timer. Six minutes and 16 seconds. We'll check later. We got it. We did it, boys. We got a world record. <laughs> Nick, I'm going to unmute you. All right, well, uh, that's it for this episode. Um, nice. We uh, we made some pretty good progress. Next one is going to be the 24-hour PPE. Uh, and then after that, it's, yeah, back to Mystic. Uh, so hopefully that gets us an additional uh, six stars there. It's 46, 50, 55, 60, uh, and then 72. Okay. All right, that works. Uh, thank you guys for coming. Uh, that was heat. We did it, boys. We got a Realm of the Mad God world record. I'll upload the raw footage for Shank Percent uh, after the episode. That's good record right there, about 612, I think it was. I, I, gotta, uh, I gotta go check. But uh, yeah, thanks for coming, and I'll see you all later.